gold features. In this video, we'll be going over my trade idea of the week and the day-by-day -day probability model. So let's start off with the atomic analysis on the winner chart. We are in pause MACD. We're at overbought levels with the RSI. We did bounce right off the 200 moving average, this green line, and that is at a price of $1,813. With the 4 hour chart, we are remain in pause MACD. We did see it converge and we're approaching to overbought condition with the RSI. As with the daily chart, we are in pause MACD. As with the trade idea, I'll be trading GLD. My trade position size for it is less than 1% of my portfolio. My long entry is at $165.77, and that is that range there. My sell target is at $170.30. My stop loss is at $164.88. However, if I were to open a short position, my entry is at $173.01, and that is this range here. My sell target is at $166.67. My stop loss is at $173.94. So whichever entry price were to hit first, that will be my position of the week. So how did I develop these trade ideas? It all comes from the day-by-day -day probability model. As we progress to the fifth day or week of trading, gold features has a 17% chance to climb between 0 to 2% and 8% chance to climb between 2 to 4%. The downside has a 58% chance to fall between 0 to negative 2% and a 17% chance to fall between negative 2 to negative 4%. So if you enjoyed this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.